This spring, we were really fortunate to have a pair of great horned owls nest successfully right at Officer's Row in Mammoth. When the owlets hatch, they're pretty tiny and they're not visible. It was about four weeks before any sign of activity in the nest. We were all like hopeful parents or grandparents or whatever because we were looking for any kind of sign that said the nest was successful. Shortly before the middle of May, we got to see that there were young owlets in the nest. Owlets grow pretty quickly. They can start hopping out of the nest at about six or seven weeks and be capable of short flights at about seven weeks, but they're dependent on the adults for several weeks after that, the male especially, to bring food to them. They, they're learning how to fly, but landing is always an issue, and landing on something you can eat is even more challenging. By late fall or early winter, they're going to be out of the adults' territory if they're still alive. You know, juvenile mortality is really high in the natural world, and that dispersal, not having the adults to depend on for food, is the challenging time. That's make or break time. What was fortunate about this pair this year and in previous years is they're pretty tolerant of lots of people observing them from a safe distance. It doesn't mean they're tame by any means. The distance to remain from them is still 75 feet, but people loved it because it's a treat. It's a, it's a great treat to get to see owls. I'm Katie Duffy. I'm the interpretive planner for Yellowstone National Park.